Hey guys, um, welcome to the box programming for Wednesday. So we've been working on loads of squats and that's just what we're going to be doing today as well. Okay, lots of squats. We are getting to the end of this block. This is the last week. So I am ramping up the volume. If you are lucky enough to have a bar at home, today's squats, five sets of seven reps. So a nasty rep range, close to nine, but not quite. There's still a little rep, seven reps at 77.5%. You get a rest, I'd say a good three minutes between these sets. We need that recovery time, so that's what I want you doing, okay? That's the majority of the entire workout, is that squat time. Warm up, give yourselves plenty of time to warm up, do your squat flow, maybe do some glute activation exercises as well. Once you've done that, okay, you move to the next bit. For those of you at home, however, okay, and you don't have much equipment, I still want to increase that intensity, we can increase the intensity by giving you a little bit more time under tension in the squat. So it's going to be a really slow tempo today. Plenty of sets. We've got five sets of eight reps. Okay, um, the tempo is five seconds down, five hold, five seconds up, no time to rest at the top. So it'll look like oh, five seconds, of course. Five, four, three, two, one, holding. Five seconds, and then coming up slowly for five, four, three, two, one. Going back down again, five seconds down. You're only getting 60 seconds rest between those sets, so it's going to be intense but quick. It'll be over fast. For those of you guys, it is 90 seconds as well in the squat, if my maths is correct. 15 times eight. Okay, so what you're going to be going through next up, well, 120 seconds, two minutes. Okay, what you're going to be going through in the next piece, four rounds. If you've got a barbell at home, it's a snatch deadlift, okay, with a three inch deficit, okay, so about a plate, okay, three inches, standing at the top. We know the drill with the snatch deadlift is that we've got that wide grip, we stay over the bars as long as possible in that last, but we're extending up. So five of them with a three inch deficit, 80 to 85% of your snatch. If you're at home, You've got kettlebells, a bag, okay, I could even put a bag to it. It's going to be a continual tempo moving through, okay, with just a really slow, steady three down, three down, I should say, three up with no pauses. You're doing 10 reps, so rep range is going to be much higher. Um, once you've done that, you're going to go to a single leg kettlebell deadlift. No tempo, same thing, kettlebell, dumbbell. Odd object, ideally if you've got a kettlebell, kettlebell is great, this is for people at home as well as, okay, if you've got all the kit. Okay, so what you're going to be doing through is that single leg deadlift, really figuring, focusing on closing the leg back, extending through, and then driving up nice and quick, okay, going through and doing seven of those, okay. Once you've done that, the last piece of midline, five toes to bar, it's strict. Okay, so you could go through five reps. It's a five second lower on those, however, so really challenging. I'll sit, so you can set two chairs up, two 10 second holds. Or if you want another option, you could be eight V ups with a five second lower. Okay, you'd go through that part four times. So a lot of assistance today with a big bunch of squats. That's your workout for Wednesday, guys. Enjoy and see you tomorrow.